Right. <sighs> I look for more Chobu Chan. Looks good. Guess I'll take it. I guess I need to ask myself, do I continue across, across the promenade looking for Chopo-chan, or do I go on the boat, the DLC casino? I suppose I need to decide what I want to do. Hey, you! Yes? You need to pay for your room tonight. Don't tell me you don't have any cash. No, I do. Ah, uh, thank you. Good morning. Morning. Be careful out there. Hmm? Those thugs are out there somewhere. Yeah, I know. You should watch out too. Right. Stay away from anyone suspicious looking. Then come find me. Okay, I will. What is the prize of the arcade today? It is a white teddy bear, which I'm pretty sure I have, yep. Alright. So I don't need that. It says, do I continue on the promenade or do I go? on the, the boat, which is a, a gambling area. Which is DLC, so I'm not sure. Hmm. I don't know. It's not a big ship. So it shouldn't be, it shouldn't take that long. I should go fishing for once. See what that's all about. Yeah, why not? Excuse me. Hey there! Here to fish? If you're looking to fish, come rent yourself a rod. What are you fishing with today? I'll take this. Thanks for the business. You can fish anywhere there's a fish symbol. Tracking them all down is half the fun. Got it. But it won't let me go here. Looks like I can't get through here. Huh. So that must be something related to the story. Um. No fishing symbols here. 
but I remember there was one near the dock. With the forklift, so there was one. I hope it was over here. No. Or towards that guy. Yep, right here. I think I can fish here. I think I can fish here. Come on. Or maybe not. I assumed that I could go to the area on the left, but I guess not. Come on, give me something. Okay, these fish, uh, they're bigger. Without a doubt, they're bigger. Over in Bailu, I was getting two, three hundred grams. Getting over a thousand here, so that's good. Assuming there are any fishing style uh, DLC quests that I'm not aware of. Big boy, a big boy, all right.
Going fishing, making some money. Good times. That's enough fishing. That's fine. I'll pass. Well, that's life. I guess that wasn't a good haul, but whatever. I'm not looking to do any story-related things. Uh, alright, so... I guess, uh... I guess I can visit the DLC now. Before I progress in the story to see what that's like. FPS, what's going on? Right. on Am I doing 100%? I'm not actively looking, uh, because again, I this is my very first playthrough, so I honestly don't know what even constitutes 100%. Don't be shy. You can look without playing. I just need to get you inside to meet my quota. Check this out. But I do want to get all the capsule toys that I can see, uh, and get all of the uh, the move scrolls that I can find. So, I'm going to check out this DLC area, which is a big boat, which is Chobu Big Merry Cruise, has a restaurant, game floor, and an arcade. Might as well see what it has, right? Thank you so much for coming. This is the ship's general information desk. I see. We welcome any and all questions here, so please do not hesitate to ask. We are currently offering daily challenge missions to our patrons. You will not want to miss out on this amazing opportunity. Challenges, huh? Yes. Would you like to hear more about challenge missions? When was this added? Uh, I don't know, because I started playing this much later than the retail launch. This launched back in November of last year. And it was already out by the time I played it, so I don't know. Tickets to spin the big wheel for marvelous prizes. The target of the challenge missions will change on a daily basis. Five hits on flower, bird, wind, and moon, for example. Hmm, I see. The game itself does not change in any way, so just get some tokens ready and play. Thanks. I think I got it now. Today's challenge missions are for Roll It On Top and Turtle Racing. All right then. Best of luck to you. I can get a big wheel ticket by completing daily challenge missions. Sorry to bother you. Welcome, sir. If you wish to play, you will first need to purchase tokens. Right, tokens. Once you have them, you may play whichever game you like as much as you like. If you are yeah, Rex. to earn a great many tokens, good evening. You may trade them in for wonderful prizes. Or good morning, depending on Thank you. the time frame. All right then. Best of luck to you. 
Excuse me. Thank you so much for coming. We are currently offering daily challenge missions to our patrons. You will not want to miss out on this amazing opportunity. Challenge missions, you say? Yes. Chillin', nice. Would you like to hear more about challenge missions? Uh, she already told me about them, so that's fine. Thanks. All right then. Today's challenge missions are for making a pizza, huh? And turtle racing. Okay. Please enjoy yourself. Look at that. Good stuff. What type of pizza are you doing? I know you're all about that sausage, baby. Now the question, is there a Chobuchan in this ship? Oh man. I have no idea. Chicken? Okay. Hey, what up, Nerd Strategy? Recording gameplay for Thursday's video. What, uh... What video are you doing? Hey there! Come and get your tokens! What is this place? Hmm? Why, hello there! Looking for tokens? Doing a Dragon Ball game, I presume, or...? Tokens? That's right! Can't play without your tokens. So, how many will it be? Hmm. Forgive me, but... Hey there! You here for tokens? Another time, maybe. Okay, then. Come back soon. Okay, so that doesn't go in the notebook, which is interesting. Got those Elton John glasses. Living the good life. Why, hello there. Step right up and exchange for prizes. Excuse me. Why, hello there. Here to exchange. So, for anyone hopping in, I. This is five viewers, so thank you. Prizes. This is a DLC for Shenmue 3. Tons of great prizes in stock. I'm sure you'll find something you like. I. See. So, it's a big boat with a lot of gambling areas. Um, and it looks like there may be some new games. So, that'll be interesting to take a look at. Here to claim some prizes? They're all yours, as long as you've got the tokens for them. We've got tons of great prizes in stock. I'm sure you'll find something you like. Alright. Is there something I need? Ooh, a Sega Saturn. Game console sold all over the world. The later models were white in color. Oh. Okay, so there are some new items here. But I don't think I need any of these for the, uh, for my skill books. Pretty sure I found these all elsewhere. Actually, wait, this civilian shuttle, I think I need. So I might need that. Are you finished here? That's fine. So, let me look. Uh, um, skill book exchange. And... 
already have that move, so that's fine. Sapphire. Military shuttle. Corundum. Okay. Black Hawk. Sapphire, I need. And military shuttle in Corundrum. Here to claim. They're all you. We've got. I'm. Which I don't have any of those. Um, civilian shuttle. you found something you like okay you can hold on to it or sell it to a pawn shop when money gets tight go to a pawn shop see you around so we hope i didn't screw that up Oh, damn. I got the wrong one. <laughs> I need military shuttle. Whoop. We've got... I'm... Oh, well. Glad you found something you like. My mistake. So now... Here we are. Red and ceramic board. Indigo porcelain pot. I don't think they were here. We've got I'm sh Nope. Right. Are you finished? Cool. Well, I got one item at least. But the question is, is uh is Chobu Chan here because it's DLC? Does it count? I don't know. That'd be scary if Chopo Chan's here. This is a big area. Is this big wheel challenge mission jackpot bonus prize press for a big wheel ticket one ticket one spin oh. oh 
No, no, no. Just when I finally got my hands on the Stargirl figurine. Oh, uh, sorry, kid. Just looks like a quest, maybe. Sorry. What are you gonna do about it? Um, what's wrong? Oh, hey there. I, uh, I accidentally broke that kid's doll. Doll? <laughs> huh? Who are you, anyway? And this is no ordinary doll. Stargirl is a super rare figurine that my sister loves. Your sister? Yeah. I have a younger sister who's sick. Oh. Is it something serious? It's not supposed to be, but she's lost the will to fight it. The doctor even said that at this rate, she's not going to recover anytime soon. Sorry to hear that. So, I thought getting her this rare figurine from her favorite anime would cheer her up. Oh boy, I'm so sorry. I'll reimburse you. I promise. It's not about the money. Huh? This figure, you can only win it at the big wheel. That's why it's super rare. Really? I had no idea. I love my little sister to death. Do you know how many hours of sleep I've lost? How many meals I've skipped just to get this thing? I... So what should I do then? You go to the big wheel and win me a brand new one. You've got to be kidding me. Oh, come on. I just... I guess my sister's never going to get better. I, I want to have a feeling he's lying. I don't think he's telling the truth. I give up then. It's game over. All that time and money. Wow. That's it. If I can't save my sister, I might as well jump into the Li Xiang River. What? Sweet little sis, please forgive me. I'll be waiting for you on the other side. W w slow down. Look, I'll take care of it, okay? What? I'll play the big wheel and win you another figurine, okay? Really? Yeah, I promise. So just sit tight. In that case, I'm counting on you. Please, please save my sister. I don't need anything but that figurine. If you're serious about this, then I'm counting on you too. I'll even reward you. Um. Please. Uh, thank the heavens for sending you. How much you want to bet they're... Huh. All right. They're con artists. And they're going to swindle me because they're going to sell it for money. This offers like a Sailor Moon. Parody. A man was fighting with an older man. The old man bumped into him and broke his figure. The figure was of the main character from his six sister's favorite anime. Apparently it's a rare big wheel prize and very important to him. What an upstanding big brother. Require a new figure for him. Excuse me. Sorry. That's what I feel, Rax. I know it's tough, but I'm really counting on you. It's okay. I'll give it a shot. At my age, games like Lucky Hit and Fr they're they're conning me. Are a complete mystery to me. That's why I figured I'd ask someone younger to win for me and spin that big whatever it is. I'll do what I can. Thanks. Excuse me. Oh, what am I going to do if my sister's illness kills her? There's no point for me to go on living anymore. Oh, boy. It's no use. Nothing can be done. I'll join her in the afterlife. Step away from the ledge, friend. I'll help you find the action figure. R really? I'd be so grateful. You have no idea. I'll dedicate the rest of my miserable little life to you. I wow. <laughs> um, yeah, well, I'll do my best. All right. 
So, luckily I can save scum. Assuming the uh, hit is too big. So how do you play this? Use the prize now, but uh, how do I get this to work? Because I do have big tickets, I know that. Um, I got them in Bailu Village. Red, green, blue, yellow. Well, this is the red big wheel. So how do you play it? Excuse You need tokens to play. Feel free to enjoy your- All right. Excuse me. Thank you. We are current- You will not- Challenge me. Yes. Please do. If you complete the missions offered at the various game stations, you can earn tickets to spin the big wheel for marvelous prizes. Oh, okay. The target of the challenge missions will change on a daily basis. So I should need to play games to get tickets to use it. Bird, wind, and moon, for example. Hmm. The game itself does not change in any way. So thanks. Today's challenge missions, please. The roll it on top. And turtle races. So, lucky hit. Greetings. Want to try the lucky hit game? Hi there. Greetings. Want to try the lucky hit game? I just want to. No, no, no. That won't do at all. Excuse me? You shouldn't put moves on someone while they're working. Um, no. That's not why I'm. Well, how about it? Want to earn a bit of pocket change with a game of Lucky Hit? Hmm. Lucky Hit, huh? Want to play? Maybe some other time. Do come again. Damn it all. These oysters. Chicken. Or not chicken turkey. Damn it all. So these are the turtle races. Hey boss! How about a frog race? Alright. Hey handsome! How about a turtle race? Yes, I will do that. Or you know what? No, these aren't the uh games it's roll it on top and flower sun bird and moon do you enjoy dice games how about a round of roll it on top well hello there how about some flower bird wind and moon sir pardon me how about a challenge mission you can give it a go right now if you want. A challenge mission? Win ten times at Roll It On Top, and you'll earn yourself tickets for the big wheel. Ten times? Oh. I see. Spin the big wheel, and you're sure to win big prizes. Got it. Thanks a lot. Step right up for a Roll It On Top challenge mission. Are you up for the challenge? All right, then. So, how many tokens would you like to bet? I'll go first. Total of... Six. Who knows how this will turn out? Hmm. Alright, one, two, three, four, five. Huh. Total of... Yes, sir. 
You did it! This is starting to get interesting. Play again? Maybe some other time. Okay, gonna hold you to that. You've yet to complete your mission, but all of your wins from today are still valid. Please come again to continue the mission. Okay, so it's not to do it in a row, so that's good. If it was to win ten times in a row, that'd be impossible. Um, hey there. A challenge mission, is it? Win, roll it on, give it a try. All right, then. I'll go first. Oh, eight. Total of... Not gonna beat that. Eight. Oh, wow. <clears throat> this is getting interesting. Nope. He won. Total of... This is why you save scum. Not going to be easy. You can still make a comeback. We'll Maybe some. Okay, you've yet to please come. This is why safe scumming is important. Uh, hey there. Win, give it a try. All right then. Go Ooh, three? Oh, all right. Love? Got this all day. Three. Oh my, that didn't go well. Three, four, five. Huh. Total of nine. Congratulations. This is starting to get interesting. Play a Maybe some. Okay, you've yet to com please come. That's two. Hey there, win, roll, give it a try. All right then. I'll go first. Five. Total of five. I could do better. I could do better. That roll. One, two, three, four, five. Huh. How'd the pizza turn out, Rex? Still cooking it? Yes, yeah, sir. Number three. Eight. That's three wins. You did it. This is starting. Yeah, to nice. Play again. Good stuff, dude. Okay, you've yet to please come. Alright, so I gotta win seven more times. Um hey, win give it a try. Send me some pictures, dude. I'm I'm actually curious to see how that turned out. Did you make it like a circle or a square? Or not square, rectangle. Alright then. So how many tokens would you like to bet? Always max bet. Always. And ooh, five, eight. Love eight. Probably not gonna beat that. Is getting interesting. One, two, three, four, five. <clears throat> nope. That's a five he won. Love five. It you can maybe some okay. You've yet to please come again. You lose. Just load it right back up. Not a big deal. Um, hey there, win, roll, give it a try. All right, then. I'll go first. Three? Or I could definitely do better than that. Love? Three. Oh my, that didn't go well. One, two, three, four, five. Huh. Go for seven. Six. Yeah, I still won. So that's four. Congratulations. This is 
and maybe some okay you've yet to complete please come I wonder how you keep tab of your wins is it located in the uh, notebook or I wonder um hey there win give it a try all right then. I'll go first seven total of seven okay this is a good round one two three four five get a nine get a nine roll a nine roll a nine six seven eight nine total of nine haha -ha, called it congratulations yes sir yes sir in five more to complete the challenge mission all right so it is keeping track You've yet please come. I'm halfway there. Um Hey there. Win roll. Give it a try. All right then. I'll go first. 5 Total of 5. All right. All right give me give me a 7. 1 2 3 4 Five. Seven, 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 seven. Five, we're tied. So he wins. Because it's tied. It's not going to be easy. You can still make a comeback. Will you? Maybe some. Okay. You've yet to. Please come. Hey there, win, give it a try. All right then. I'll go first. Total of seven or eight. Oh wow. Oops. This is getting interesting. One, two, three, four, five. Give me a nine or a ten. Nope. Six, six seven, eight. We're tied again. So he wins. It, you can maybe some. Okay, you've yet. To please come. So I don't know who's watching on Facebook, but thank you for watching. Uh, hey there, win. Ro give it a try. All right then. Go first. All right, five. Love five. I don't feel good about that roll. One, two, three, four, five. Huh. Tied again, man. Love what the fuck? Five. It. You can. It's three ties in a row. Maybe some. Okay. You've yet to please come. <clears throat> That's dirty. Uh, hey there, win, roll, give it a try. All right, then. I'll go first. Four. Okay. Do better than that. Lady Luck is on your side. One, two, three, four, five. Give me a six or a seven. Ooh. Total of eleven. Eleven. Congratulations. <laughs> you know, sometimes when I take a shit, I think about you, Aldo. Ooh. It's bug dirty to me, baby. I love it. What is it when you got those like long logs or is it when it's that fucking to complete your mission liquidy shit from today please come i love it i love it rex don't don't ever change who you are shoot a man this is it's flower bird wind and do i want to know why 
Absolutely. Um, hey there. When you tell me. All right then. I'll go first. Five. Okay. Love. Five. I don't feel good about that roll. Give me an eight. One, two, three, four, five. Eight. Eight. Five, six, seven, eight. Congratulations. Win three more. Yes. All right. Okay. You've yet to please come. Three more times. Perfect. Um, hey there. Win. Give it a try. All right. Then. If you guys want to go to wipe my ass, I go, man, I think Aldo might be right about getting a bidet. I need to get one too. Trust, but this is getting interesting. it's a fucking game changer, Rex. Two, three, four, five. I'm not gonna win. Oh, tied. Total of eight. Oh shit, Frank! What up, dude? That's too bad. What's going on? Maybe some. Okay, you've yet. To please come. Hey, Rex, I'll take it. I will take that. In the highest regard. Because taking a shit is a very intimate, intimate thing. And if I can, if you can think of me in your most vulnerable state, I love it. All right, then. So how many tokens? I'll go first. Playing some Shenmue, my man. I can't ask for much more. Looks like Lady Luck is on. So this is a, a DLC area. It's like a big ship with a bunch of gambling areas. And I'm doing a side mission right now to try to get a uh, a toy. All right, I win. Good. Six. Congratulations. You know what, Rex? You surprise me every time. So it could go either way. It's a 50 50. But that's, dare I say, romantic. So thank you. Hey there. Win, give it a try. All right then. I'll go first. Aim to keep it that way. That's what's up. That's so you, Rax. It's so you. That didn't go well. Right, uh, three, so one, two, three, four, five, give me a seven or eight. Seven or eight. Five, six. All right, I still win. Six. Congratulations. So I need one more. Just one more to go. You're almost there. Ride that luck just a little further. Maybe some other. Okay, you've yet to please come. All right. Not because it's the last one; it's gonna take forever. Um. Hey there. Win. Give it a try. That's just the way it works. All right then. I'll go first. Yep. Now he's getting the big numbers. Ten. Love. Ten. Now there's a sight for sore eyes. One. Two, three, four, five. Give me a ten. No, give me an eleven. Nope. Oh, you give me a five. Total of five. It, you can maybe some. Okay, you've yet. Please come. That's all right. I can just load right back. It's as if I never lost. Yeah, Frank, what's new with you, man? How are things at work? How is life? Uh, hey there. Hope you're doing all right. Give it a try. All right then. I'm doing good, just working from home. Had today off because of the holiday. Eight. Hello? All right. Eight. But I get to play Shenmue 3 at night, so 
Do you know? I can't ask for much more. One, two, three, four, five. Give me a ten. Ten, ten, ten. Mm -hmm. Died. Love. Eight. So he wins. It, you can. St Maybe some. Okay. You've yet. Please come. So actually, Rex, uh, how did you end up getting the new ROMs for your cabinet? Is that something from like when you were when you did it with Sean? Hey there, win, give it a try. All right. Or you just decided to just upgrade the ROMs just out of nowhere? I'll go first. All right, cool. You know what? Yes, it's that's a gray area. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Wow. This is getting interesting. Doing fine, but playing my Dreamcast more. Work kind of sucks. Oh, well, you know, at the very least, you are working. So that's something that a lot of people right now don't have that luxury. So, you know, love. at least you're getting that money. It, you can. And remember, Wednesday is the 21st anniversary for the Dreamcast. Dreamcast is going to be 21 years old. It's going to be a very special day. So be sure to fire up your Dreamcast on Wednesday. Give it some love. Um, hey there. Win, roll, give it a try. All right. Then. I'll go first. Five. Total love. Okay. Five. I don't feel good about that roll. One, two... Three, four, five. Give me nine. 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 It's a gift, I tell you. A gift. I win. You did it. You completed the challenge mission. For your reward, you'll be getting a set of ten big wheel tickets. Hell yeah. Congratulations on your victory. I hope you'll challenge us again soon. All right. All right. I love it. I love it. So, what is it? Key items? Nope. Items. Received from games in the sailing venture needed to play the big wheel. So, we have 10 tries. Um. Hey there. A challenge mission, is it? Win, roll it on top ten times to earn your... Give it a try? No. Maybe some other... Okay. What about the roll it on top? There's no... Oh, yes, there is. <clears throat> but you know what? I... I don't need to do it, because I can theoretically just save scum with the big reel here. What if my Dreamcast is already out and regularly played? What do I do? That's great. And it's a wonderful thing that you're giving the Dreamcast some love. But still, on Wednesday, be sure to give your Dreamcast a nice big hug. Open up a bottle of wine. Or a nice uh, beer. Set some candles. And be like, Dreamcast, baby. I'm going to treat you out a night in the town. Let's go. Roll one and play some Power Stone too. Nice. Good stuff. Alright, so. I gotta try to win this uh, Sailor Moon knockoff. I've never played this game, but I'm assuming it's gonna be one of those things where the lights go up and I gotta stop it at a certain time. So there's a lemon, cherry, apple, teddy bear, and something. Uh, apple, maybe? No, that's something else. Bonus. So I don't know which one this one is. I play one. Well, for Dreamcast birthday, I'm off on that day, so I'll be playing it all day. Nice. Good stuff. Right. Remember those stupid ads where it said 9999? 
I love those ads. What are you talking about? They're not stupid at all. I, I remember the ads when they would show... It would zoom in on the inside of the Dreamcast. And it would show all the characters just hanging out. And there was like that kid. What's the name? Steve from Hackensack, New Jersey. And like it showed Tails talking with Afro Thunder and the NBA 2K characters. Those commercials were awesome. Ooh, okay. Uh, there's a meter. So I don't really know. I'm guessing it's color coded. But what color is the doll? I don't really understand how this works. Um, I'm going to try to go... Oh, that's the force of the spin. Okay, okay, okay. Alright. I'm assuming it wants to land on the bonus. Would be the ideal place. Let's give it a weaker spin. Oh, so close. So close. Oh, shit. It landed. Holy fuck. All right. I'll take that. That went well. Hell yeah. I got the figure I needed. Bring it to the brother. It's a melon? Okay. I wanted gameplay. Those were good commercials, but when it was releasing, it should have been marketed better. Uh, you know what? At the very least, it made everyone remember September 999. So, you know, from a marketing standpoint, it worked because that, that date was ingrained in everyone's head. And honestly, you know, when if you went to a Toys R Us, if you went to a Funko Land, uh, Babbage's, Electronics Boutique, Software, etc., and you saw the Dreamcast kiosk running with NFL 2K, Sonic Adventure, Ready to Rumble Boxing, Soul Calibur, that's all you needed to see. That was enough to sell the system, in my opinion. Why was it 14,000 units in two weeks? Is that what it was? Well, again, you have to think about the time, too, though. You know, um, there weren't as many stores, and marketing was mostly done through TV or video game magazines. So it's not like you can't really compare it to maybe today, where everything is super instant. Um, you know, and still, you know, the Dreamcast, even though it may not have sold as astronomically high as, say, a Genesis did, um, one, the Genesis was around much longer, and two, the Genesis had very strong markets in international areas like Portugal and Brazil, South America, where it still, to this day, has a huge following, um, but even even so, if you were to take that two hour, or not two hour, two year window where the Dreamcast was made, was available, it achieved in those two years a strong enough library to rival any other system that would have taken them five to ten years to amass a level of quality that good. So, you know, I mean, it also depends on what you're looking for. If you grew up in the arcade era... And if you were all about arcade games outside of a Neo Geo, you really couldn't get the arcade experience, but you could with a Dreamcast, and it was affordable, unlike the Neo Geo. So Calibre was crazy, absolutely. Especially if you compare it to the arcade version, which was running on System 32. It was a night and day difference. Uh... Total difference. And I think Dreamcast, for me, is honestly the poster child for next generation. You, you toss around the word next gen. And when you saw Dreamcast games running in 1999, that truly was 
a next a generation leaps and bounds compared to PlayStation and N64 and Saturn. And I don't think in our history of games there hasn't been that significant a jump in fidelity um, going from Xbox to Xbox 360 and the new stuff. They're very minor increments, but the Dreamcast really was a revolutionary upgrade in pretty much every technical aspect you could think of. Do I talk to him or do I, do I talk to the kid? Mm. What is it? Did you get me that action figure? Yes. I won the figure at the big wheel. Oh, thank you. This is such a relief. I'm glad it worked out. Give it to that boy for me. I'm sure he'll be thrilled. I'll head over there now. Oh, I almost forgot. Oh, he gives me a prize. I forgot what exactly? Come back after you give him the action figure. All right. I want to reward you for what you've done. Okay. Thanks. See you later. I still feel like they're going to swindle me. Oh, it's 7 o'clock already. It was the first 128-bit system. Video games were hype as fuck during N64 and PlayStation days. They were, but again, it definitely didn't have the mainstream appeal like it does now, mainly because of online culture. It's really made everything accessible, you know? Um, I mean, yes, uh, People who had the video games had the video games, but, you know, like, for example, a Neo Geo. Who had a Neo Geo back then? Unless you were extremely rich. And even so, a Neo Geo, you couldn't go into an EB Games get a Neo Geo. That was usually special order. Um, so things were a bit different back then, you know? Um, but I definitely feel the Dreamcast was the last console to really do the arcade uh games justice because pretty much american arcades died off right after the dreamcast during the playstation 2 xbox era um but for me that's kind of what makes the dreamcast so special because it was the last console to pretty much put a big focus on that arcade experience to bring it home you had so many games that were running at 60 frames a second which was an arcade staple back then um and yes, I mean, yes, those games are, are short, simplistic, but because of the nature of the way they are, the replayability is, is near infinite. And I'll, I would take a 30-minute arcade game over a 200-hour game today. You know, that's just me, though. PlayStation 2 came out right after within that year. All of a sudden, the hype went up even more for video games. I mean, if you're talking about on a mainstream level, yeah. Um, you know, because the, the PlayStation 2 was, for many people, the very first affordable DVD player. So I think more people bought the PlayStation with that in mind. And that's kind of what killed the Dreamcast in America, uh, because it didn't have a DVD drive. And, you know, you have to remember at that time in the early 2000s, DVD players were three, four, five hundred dollars $500. Um, so this was the first consumer affordable DVD player. Um, so that was a big thing. Yes, the games were there, but it was easier to justify for families. Be like, oh, okay, I can get a DVD player here as well. So if I buy this PlayStation 2 for little Timmy, we could also use it to watch movies. Um, so that's definitely a big, a big thing, a uh, selling point. Excuse me. What is it? I don't want to hear from you until- All right, so are these guys going to con me or what? I won the action figure at the big wheel. It took me forever to get it. It's no easy task. I... Wait, what? Um, I got the action figure you wanted. You... you did? Now, is he being genuine, or is he going to screw me over?
premium star girl figure premium figure from the popular star girl idol anime series very much sailor moon or yeah well sailor moon and like i don't know popful male mix Let me give it to him. Here. Wow, you weren't kidding. A super rare star girl action figure. Uh huh. Thank you. Thank you so much. Now my sister will surely recover. I'm glad to hear it. Wait for me, sis. I'm coming. You'll have this figure in your hands before you know it. <sighs> Looks like it all worked out in the end. He gave the figure to the brother. He was very happy. I hope his sister gets better. Okay, so he actually didn't swindle me. That's interesting. Hi there. Oh, it's you, the man who saved our lives. Um, I wouldn't go that far. Uh, no, seriously. I really mean it. You gave my sister hope. Well, that's great if true. And yet... Hmm? I can't just let anyone meet her. Oh, okay. You see, my sister is incredibly cute. I'm constantly worrying about freaks approaching her. F freaks, huh? Oh, don't get me wrong. I'm not talking about you. <laughs> right. Well... I'll see you around. Say hi to your sister for me. Oh, Rio with the smooth moves. Look at that. But yeah, FPS. Um, I'm not sure if you uh, are mistaking. I I'm not trying to be argumentative or anything like that. Um, I'm just saying that the Dreamcast uh, definitely has a very special place in history you know even though it's shelf life was not that long um i dare say overall it had a stronger lineup than say a playstation 2 um because e even if you compare something as simple as like the launch window you're talking about you know day one or year one uh i would say that the dreamcast definitively has a far better window of games in that time than the PlayStation did. Because uh, obviously, you know, Dreamcast Day 1, you had NFL 2K, House of the Dead 2, Power Stone, Ready to Rumble Boxing, Sonic Adventure, Soul Calibur, um, and others, Hydro Thunder, um, some other ones that I'm not thinking about right now. And in PlayStation 2, when it launched, and please correct me if I'm wrong, but... There were games like Fantavision, The Bouncer, um, I think Tekken 5 or Tekken 4. Um, like on the whole, it wasn't it wasn't until after a year where like the really more popular quality stuff started coming out. Um, but again, the DVD factor was a was a big thing. Because again, DVD players were very expensive back then. So the fact that the PlayStation had it built in was it was a big selling point. And also the fact that they were getting the NFL games, uh, Madden in particular, because Madden is a very mainstream, you know, it, it bleeds where people who don't play video games but love football will buy Madden and only play Madden and nothing else. But that's like kind of a locked fan base that you got with the PlayStation 2. Um, and again, I'm not disparaging the PlayStation 2 by any means. Um, it's for the people who loved it. It was a, a very special system to them. It's just me personally. The Dreamcast was something that uh, that I prefer. But I'm a Sega fanboy, so that's me. Ah, oh, Blue Stinger. Yeah, that uh, that Resident Evil clone. You're right. You're right. But anyways, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go get a drink because all this gambling has made me thirsty. So. I will be right back.
just make sure that the camera is not lagging. Uh, but yeah, I will be right back. All right, come back here and ensure that the game is back on screen, which it is. All right, cool. So 
So let me talk to the old man, see what he will give me. Hi there. Oh, it's you. Did you give that action figure to the boy for me? Yes. He was really happy to get it. Oh, good. Good. Take this as a small token of my gratitude. I hope it suits you. Oh, shit. Purple Flame Martial Arts Wear. It's a whole ghetto. Huh? What is this? I sell Western clothes. I thought I'd give you a sample from my stock. Thank you so much. I also got some of those things used to get prizes. Feel free to spin that big widget or whatever it's called. Oh, he's giving me tickets too. For big wheel prizes. The old man was relieved. He gave me martial arts wear as thanks. The old man was a prize dealer. New outfits have been added as big wheel prizes. Okay. Okay. Hello there. Oh, it's you. Back for more games, eh? You must do quite well for yourself. I wouldn't say... Oh, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> if you say so. I got some clothes from my shop to add to the ship's prizes. Try and win them if you like. Thank you. Okay, so... Here it is. Deep purple martial arts wear. Oh, snap. So I could, in theory, dress Rio up like this. Make him look all fancy. So you know what? For the, for the sake of this ship, I will change his outfit. Look at that. Look at how Rio would look. Like a player. Look at him. He's out. Ready to date. Look at that. Look at Rio. Looks like he belongs in the Yakuza games now. My man. Alright. Oh, but now there's other outfits that you could win. Ah. So for those of you who are watching, should I try to spin the wheel to get this nice jade green outfit? Landy-ish outfit? Hmm. That's, uh... Tempting. Very tempting. for it. Alright, so. Save. And. Maybe I should play. Alright. Go for a weak spin. This isn't going to work. Nope. That's fine. I can just reload if need be. Ooh, too far. 
Este... So again, I'll go through my tickets, and in case I don't win, I can just reload. It's like I didn't lose. Bear too. I'm pretty sure I have that one. Nope. I'll come back later. Oh, it's nine o'clock. That's what. Look at the time. I should get back to the hotel. Well, I could just reload. That's fine. But actually, let me make sure. It's Teddy Bear 2. Honestly, that's I don't have teddy bear. Okay. By the way, let me reload. It is a pretty nice outfit. Um, I must say, it is pretty cool. Very dapper. Yes, yes, first try. Jade Phoenix martial arts wear. All right. That went well. Oh, but see, now there's a red one. Now there's a red one. That's how we get you. Deep green martial arts wear. See, now, now they're gonna screw me over. It's gonna be like, I gotta get a ball now. Yo, Jason, what up, dude? Same to you, man. Same to you. Have a good one. All right, well, I gotta get the red now, right? Wouldn't be complete. It's about to be nine o'clock. All right, so it seems the weakest spin is the best chance. So far, it's worked for me. Not this time, though. Hey, what up, John? What up, dude? How you doing tonight? I'll pass. Oh, not a, I only have a chance to spin it once. Look at the time. I should get back to the hotel. Yes, someone did mention Blue Stinger. You know, I, I never, uh, I never owned that game, so I didn't really uh, give it a fair shake. But I know nowadays it's gone up in value. So, as most games tend to do, but Dreamcast and Saturn in particular, and GameCube, GameCube games are going up. Look at this outfit, man. Look at Rio. Shenhua? Hi, Rio. We've got to find my father, and fast. The city's huge, but we have to take our time and look for clues. I know. Rio, I'm going to go back to the room. Okay. Man, I kind of don't want to change back to the original outfit. Looks so good on. I used to own it and he sold it and rebought it. Okay. 
GameCube's going crazy. Yeah, a lot of games on GameCube are just astronomical right now. I think it's more a case of just everyone locked in and people are now pining for retro. And GameCube is sadly considered to be retro now, so... Man, I kind of I kind of don't want to take off this outfit. It's pretty nice. I'm not gonna lie. Ah, uh, but the cutscene is just a standard clothes. Oh, look at that. Ah, uh, so it doesn't it doesn't keep the outfit you have on. So that's a pre-rendered cutscene. Yeah, what's up with you, John? How are things? Hope your hope your uh, Labor Day holiday went well. Ooh, so what do you guys think? Should I keep this on? Should I go back to the default outfit? Or actually, I have a new one now too. I have a green one. To make him look like Landy. Hmm. I feel like I'm betraying the game by accessorizing Ryo past his default jack and jeans. Hey, you. Yes. You need to pay for your room tonight. The green one? Don't tell me you don't have any cash. No. Alright, I'll put on the green one. Let's see if Shenhua looks at me any different. There we go. Look at this guy looking like Landy now. Hi, Vio. Hey, Shenhua. Good morning. Morning. Are you well? Yeah, I'm totally fine. I should be asking you that. How's the city treating you? I'm getting used Things to are going well. I was Thanks going to stream tonight, but couldn't decide yeah. what. Good. Oh, you might play some I'll Fantasy Star Online. Okay. Okay, be careful. Nice. Yeah, so the original, or is it uh, episode... Weren't there two releases on Dreamcast, right? Episode one, or whatever? Hey, Shenhua. Yes? Let me know if you find anything. I'll do the same for you. Yes, of course. Is it just me, or does Shenhua look at Ryo? With a little bit more longing. Now that he's wearing this outfit, huh? Yes, Ryo was Landy all along. It's the conspiracy. It's been revealed. So you know what? I'm just going to check what the prize is at the arcade. In case I don't have it. Oh, Alright. I already have that teddy bear, so that's fine. Episode 2? Okay. Both PSOs were the same thing, just one was called version 2. I think it just had updates, this was before patches. Yeah, you're right, you're right. But the Dreamcast Online did allow for patchwork to happen. But that was more of a luxury then, so it was more cost-effective to release an entirely new disc with it. You're right. Just let me go back in here. Try to win that red jacket, huh? The red suit. Oh, wait. Jiaxing! Where are you, Jiaxing? Another side quest. Hmm. 
<sighs> Where'd that boy go? Um, everything okay? What? Oh, excuse me. Is something the matter? Yeah. I can't seem to find my son. What? Did something happen to him? <sighs> it's all my fault. I was gambling and I got so into it that I stopped watching him. I see. I see. I spent the past few hours looking for him on this ship, but... Hey, wait a minute. Could someone have kidnapped him? Wait, what? This is no time to rest. I have to find my boy. <laughs> Hold on, calm down. <sighs> Sorry. I've been walking nonstop. Uh, are you alright? Hey, I have an idea. Would you mind looking for my son? Excuse me? Please. My boy means the world to me. Uh-huh. He's a really cute boy. So you'll recognize him as soon as you see him. Okay, so what does he look like? He has a smile that shines like diamonds. And his cheeks are pink as peaches. His eyes are big and round. He's also obedient and listens. He's a really good kid. I see. Hmm. Please help me. I'm a father in need. You have to find my son. That's part of the charm, John. I, um... I'm begging you, please. I love it. Okay, fine. I'll look for him. Thank you so much. My poor son. Oh, please find him. Yeah, I have a feeling that it's not his actual son. It's some kind of toy or valuable. Something doesn't seem quite right. I met a father looking for his son. It seems he'd gotten lost. Features. A smile that shines like diamonds. Big round eyes. Cheeks as pink as peaches. Search the boat. Hello there. Oh, please. Please, find my son for me. I will. I just need to ask you a few questions about him first. He's a really cute boy. So you'll recognize him as soon as you see him. I will. Uh... His eyes are big and round. His smiling face is like that of an angel. Uh, okay. His cheeks are pink as peaches. You could mistake him for a doll. I see. And that's why you have to find him before it's too late. I'll try. Sounds fishy. Sounds fishy. Eyes like diamonds. Rosy cheeks. Not him. Sorry to bother you. Thank you so much for coming. I just need some help. Yes? I'm looking for a lost child. A lost child? That sounds dire indeed. Could you describe this child? It's a boy. And his father says he's absolutely adorable, for what it's worth. An adorable little boy, huh? He has a smile that shines like diamonds, and his cheeks are pink as peaches. Hmm. Oh yeah, he also has big, round eyes. Have you seen anyone like him? No. Unfortunately, no one who fits that description comes to mind. Kind of a bad dad if you miss someone like that, yeah. And after you find him and lose him again, yeah, absolutely. Right, so this kid isn't it, because it won't let me interact with him. Hello there. Hmm? Actually, I'm here for something else. Oh, and what might that be? 
I'm looking for a lost child. A lost child? What kind of child? He's a boy, and his father says he's absolutely adorable, for what it's worth. A cute kid and a boy. Have you seen him? Can't say I've seen any pretty boys around here. Okay, thanks. A little, little odd choice of words. Sorry to bother you, but... Why, hello? Actually, I'm here for something else. What is it? I'm looking for a lost child. A child? Can you tell me more? He's a boy, and his father says he's absolutely adorable. For what it's worth. A little cutie, huh? Hmm. Have you seen him? I've seen a bunch of kids, but I wouldn't say any of them were particularly adorable. Okay, I understand. Biden words for sure. Yeah, that's kind of accurate. I didn't notice these jackets here. Oh, these are all the colors. Green, red, blue, gray, white, and gold. Oh boy. I got a whole collection of and jackets too. Oh man. Oh, calling my name, but I need to do the quest first. Excuse me. Are you enjoying yourself? Um, I'm getting by. I brought some clothes from my shop to add to the ship's prizes. Too many unadorable Try kids. And win them if you like. Okay. See you later. Hello there. Greetings. Want to try the lucky hit game? I just need some help. What is it? I'm looking for a lost child. A child? Mind telling me more? It's a boy. And his father says he's absolutely adorable, for what it's worth. Absolutely adorable, you say? He has a smile that shines like diamonds, and his cheeks are pink as peaches. Have you seen anyone like him? No, I can't say I have. That red and black jacket's nice, sir. Uh, I mean, they all look nice in different ways. Why can't I find anyone who's seen him? Maybe I should ask his father for more specifics. He said he's like a doll. So the... It's not a boy. It's something else. No one has seen a lost boy. What could this mean? Talk to the father again. It's some kind of jewel or boy or capsule toy. Do you have a minute? Oh, there you are. Did you find my son? I haven't even found someone who's seen him. You're kidding. You'd have to be blind not to see a kid as cute as him. One glance at him and he'd be etched into your brain forever. Um, I bet. Anyway, I was hoping to ask you a few more questions. That's what I'm thinking. What more do you need to know? Big round eyes? Cheeks as pink as peaches? No, not that. What about his clothes or his hair? Oh, right. He keeps his hair buzzed short and was wearing a yellow shirt. Buzzed hair and a yellow shirt, huh? Yes, and before I forget, his name is Leon Jiangxing. All right, thanks. That gives me more to work with. Gave a name, but yeah, it does sound very fishy. His name is John Shin. He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Ask around one more time. Excuse me. Thank you. I just need... Ask me anything. I'm looking for a lost child. A lost child? That sounds dire indeed. Could you describe this child? He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Buzzed hair and yellow clothes? Yes! That precocious little hellion! Uh-oh. That... Wait. He's a troublemaker. Oh my. Please forgive me. I have most certainly seen the boy you seek. You did? Oh yes. That little prick. 
I mean, boy. Oh, shit. Appears to be quite stricken with me. Seriously? When I declined his advances, he, um, touched my, um, buttocks. Oh, shit. <laughs> he, he did what? When I reflexively swiped his hand away, he threatened to tell his father I hit him. Sounds rough. Say, you don't know where that kid went, do you? That I do not. That precocious little... I'm so sorry. I've done it again. It's okay. I think I understand. Hmm. The plot thickens. Excuse me? Hmm? Actually, oh, I'm looking for a lost child. A lost child? What kind of child? He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Buzzed hair and yellow clothes? Ah, you mean that little brat. Oh, so you know something about him? Do I? He has a habit of swiping tokens from other customers when they're not looking. Excuse me? That little brat. He's little better than a thief. I'd love to call his parents and have them scold him. I see. Hmm. Hmm. Sorry to bother you, but... Why, hello? Actually... What is it? I'm looking for a lost child. A child? Can you tell me more? He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Buzzed hair and yellow clothes. You mean that selfish little brat, don't you? It does sound terrible. All I've seen is him whining nonstop about wanting the prizes here. Uh, sorry? I've told him time and time again that you need tokens, but he just won't listen. That's what I'm thinking, that it's the dad. When I refuse to give in, he gets moody, calling me cheap and... Because that's why the camera cut to him before. Little brat, I'd love to have a word with his parents. I... I see. So it's suspicious that it keeps going back to him. So it could be him. That would explain why he's touching women's asses and getting away with it. Excuse me. Are you enjoying yourself? Um, I brought try and all right. Okay, so I can't talk to him. Hi there. Slow down, friend. How about a turtle race? Actually, I'm here for something else. Oh, and what might that be? I'm looking for a lost child. A child? What does this child look like? He has buzzed hair. And yellow clothes. Buzzed hair and yellow clothes? Oh! You mean that little trickster! Little trickster? He flipped all my turtles over mid-race! Huh? He did what? He's really something else. <laughs> they do, John. They're all like, they're ready. That I don't know. And he better hope that I never do. I see. I mean, seriously. I heard he was also causing problems at the frog races. The frog racing station? That's right. You might want to ask them about him. Okay. Thanks for the tip. You're ready. Okay, so the frog race. Hey there. Boss! It's the boss! So, how about a frog race? Actually, I'm here for something else. Oh, all right. I'm looking for a lost child. A child? Hey, Frank. Tell me more? Shenmue 2 had duck races, so... Shenmue 3 had to up the ante. He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Buzzed hair and yellow clothes? Aha, uh -huh. you mean that little monster. Uh, monster? Not a real monster, mind you, but he certainly acts like one. Out of nowhere, he grabbed my frog mid-race with those filthy mitts of his. Is that right? He spoiled the race for everyone. All of my customers were absolutely livid. Sorry to hear that. 
And when I tried to chase him off, he took my frogs and threw them in the river. Oh, wow. That's terrible. He definitely had buzzed hair and was dressed in yellow. So, where did he go? After he tossed the frogs, he ran down into the lower deck of the ship. He was too fast for me to catch him. The lower deck of the ship, you say? That's right. So what's going to happen is in the lower deck, I'm going to find the yellow clothes. And it's going to be the dad. The dad put on a wig and changed his clothes. Father said he was a good boy, but it seems he's actually a troublemaker. Apparently he caused too much trouble and ran downstairs. Um, pardon me. We'll owe you a debt of gratitude for the rest of our lives. Because I can't just let anyone meet her, you know. I see. Sorry to bother you. Yes, the duck, the duck races were hyped. Look at these guys. They're ready. I hate to bother you, but... Wanna try? I just need... What is... I'm looking for a lost child. A child? Mind telling me more? He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Buzzed hair and yellow clothes? <laughs> I know the one. You remember him? How could I forget? He's the kid who always plays Lucky Hit with ice cream all over his hands. Afterwards, the balls and table are so sticky that I have to clean them both before anyone else can play. Sorry to hear that. I mean, you've just got to wonder where his parents are in all this. Mm. Good question. Mm. So, you don't know where that kid went, do you? No idea. I do know that he also caused trouble at the frog races, though. The frog racing station? That's right. I heard the bookie there had to chase him off. Got it. Thank you. Oh, well, you never did the duck race? So during my like my playthrough of Chenmu 2, I actually did it, but I didn't know that it would work because from what I understood, you always needed to... Uh, in the beginning of the Shenmue 2, there's a cutscene where where you chase Wang after he stole your bag. And you're supposed to fail it. Because by failing it, you end up with an alternate cutscene where you get into a fight. Um, and that leads you to the chain of events that would lead to the, the duck race. But when I did it, I didn't do it. But I still was able to talk to Izumi. And I was still able to go to the third floor of the arcade. Um, and the, the prize from beating Izumi at the arcade is to get the duck races. So I was able to do it, even though it shouldn't have worked. Uh, surprising. Sir, come right this way. Don't be shy. Huh? I mean, you came all the way here. You might as well play. Actually, I'm here for something else. Oh? And what might that be? I'm looking for a lost child. A child? He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Buzzed hair and yellow clothes, huh? I might just know the boy you're talking about. Have you seen him? Nope. He hasn't been here. There is a kid who's been angering the bookies, though. Oh? He had buzzed hair and was dressed in yellow. You don't say. I mean, seriously. It's like there's a lousy kid around every corner these days. Yeah, it sure seems that way. You don't know where that kid went, do you? I'm afraid I don't. And pretty much the key to catching the leaves, John, is um, with the camera, you gotta follow the leaf as it falls. And they're like, there's like one like half second where the camera like zooms in. That's your that's your time to hit the prompt to catch. Sorry to bother you. It's just timing. Welcome and hello there. Would you like to play some dice? Actually, I'm here for something else. Oh? I'm looking for a child. Tell me more. He has buzzed hair and yellow clothes. Oh, that kid. You know him? 
Everybody is at an absolute loss on how to deal with that little trickster. Little trickster? He often plays around here. If it looks like he's about to lose, he'll shake the table to try to give himself a better score. He does what? And if you scold him for it, he'll get twice as mad at you and give you an earful. Huh. I mean, seriously. What kind of parents would let a kid like that out of their sights? No idea. Say, you don't know where that kid went, do you? I'm not really sure. I just hope he never comes back. Oh, your kid. So maybe I'll pass. Wacky mole, smart ball. Oh, that picture is a prize. That picture is a prize for a school book. Yep. For shower of spears. Ah, oh, so I need to do that. Son of a bitch. Smart ball is uh, very annoying. You got Godzilla, Ultraman, and Gundam. I haven't seen the Gundam one before. This one's new. And golf as to uh, three prizes. That's a big blue ship. I don't know if that is a prize. Unless it's here. Doesn't look like it is. Nope. I actually don't need to win that. Oh yeah, what you been playing, Frank? Okay, so I actually have all of these. These are all good. I've acquired them already. What happens if I go upstairs? What's upstairs? Oh, Darius Burst. Okay, nice. Always nice to play some shmups. Best coffee. It's simply the best. Because this is DLC, I don't know if Chobuchan is here. This is a pretty big area, so I, I would doubt it. But you really never do know. Nothing to explore up here. <clears throat> so I guess I have no choice but to go downstairs. See what's going on. Get to the bottom of this investigation. How do you like it, Frank? Is it, is it pretty good? Oh, so can go in the door. And move three is the last Dreamcast game. I'd like to think so. Ooh, so I gotta. Oh. 
this is. Bobo chan. Hmm. This. This is. It's like an evil Bobo. This was in the hotel room as well, but these are the guys from Chenmu One in the harbor. There's nothing out of the ordinary. Enjoying it a lot, actually. Kind of wish I had a monitor. Oh, the to play it vertically. Yeah, it's definitely it spoils you once you play uh, shmups like that way they're intended. It's pretty hard to go back. Right, so lots of coffee be bags here. What's this? Uh oh. Secret stash. There's a secret stash there. Almost as if it's not intended to be there. What's with this poster? There's Chai. This can't be the real thing, can it? What the heck is this? Lot thickens, man. Something fishy going on. That's some hideout, yeah. Something funky going on for sure. brings me to the okay the other side so it just loops around okay okay I would normally stop right around now but I think I just want to get to the bottom of this and see what we can find remember when you beat him that was say like, yeah beating Chai in the arcade that's a miracle Guy always freaked me out. Yeah, with his golem voice and everything. Alright, so there's a couple of rooms. 100. He's not here. Or is he? Or is there be some clues? Oh wow, look at that. Look at that. That's literally just a JPEG. <laughs> a low res JPEG for the background there. 
Now, is that old school or is that old school? That's old school game design right there. I love it. I love it. It's literally the same picture just wrapping around over and over again. Okay. He's not here. Good times, yeah. Again, I love it, you know. Some people would say that's cheap, but that's old school to me, you know. Because, like, you see the building here. And I don't know if you can see it from the reflection. But, like, like right around where the cursor is, is where the building repeats itself. That was pretty funny. I love it. Right, so room 101. Not here. Better look elsewhere. Oh, but there's some stuff to investigate. Bunch of energy drinks, bow buns, journal, move scrolls. So somebody's living in here. Sorry. One of two. Mysterious man, mysterious. Where can this person be? Gotta love the pandas. Cutest animals ever. These are the capsule toys I got last night. Actually, these are capsule toys I haven't found yet with other animals. Okay. Room 103. Not here. Better look elsewhere. Yeah, and it doesn't hurt to just come over and just make sure that there are no small items of interest to look at. Really never do know. But yeah, as you can see, this is the same exact image. left
Not here. Better look elsewhere. A big cabinet. Some, uh, I don't know if those are biscuits or what. So I wonder how this is rendered, you know, because every time you go into a room, it fades to black, so it loads up. So is it in the same map as the boat, or like if you were to go out of bounds, would this be the only thing existing, like just this room? I'd be curious to know. Or does it actually render the entire ship? Because, I mean, the whole ship is here. But, I don't know. Interesting. How it fades to black. It's almost like it's loading a new area. He's not here. Apples, may uh, that mango? No, not mango. Um, uh, yep, green blanks, berries, uh, limes. What the hell are these? These are uh, yeah, late night brain fart, great teddy bears. Coconuts over there. You think the ship is there with the pick wraps around it? Yeah, probably. But the thing is, like, because I'm looking, I'm looking here to the right, and like the image is, is like turning. And the same thing if I look here to the left. I can tell that the image is turning around. And going by the geometry of the ship, it wouldn't be turning around that quickly. So I don't know. It would be an interesting like way to look at the, how the game renders uh, environments. Just, just a curiosity. Those are melons. Yeah, there, there you go. That was just me being stupid. Thank you, Frank. There's no one in here. I don't know, Frank. I think I think uh, you may be right. It's probably the guy all along. And in one of these rooms, you'll find the yellow shirt. So he did a switch brew. There's no one in here. It's a party. You got bourbon, you got whiskey, you got wine. Bijang beer. Rudin Yahoo. Brandy. Lemon cake.
potato chips, caramel, chicken. Hmm. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Oh wait, wait a minute. Did Rio just walk through that door? I didn't, I didn't realize. I didn't, I didn't look because I looked down. Hey, Shen World, thank you so much for the uh, host. That's very, very kind of you. Thank you. Alright, so six, seven. Right, two more rooms. Unless he's behind here. Could be. Did he walk through the door? Oh, wow. I, I looked down for a second at the chat, I didn't, but it looked odd. I'll have to look at that again. That's, that's pretty hilarious. He's not here. Hmm. Okay. Various clothes, a scale, a wallet, radio, fashion magazines, food, tokens. So again, person stealing tokens. Could this be his room? He's got various women's shoes, so it's like a cross-dresser. Uh, hmm. The plot thickens. There's no one in here. Okay. I gotta look behind here. Is anyone in there? Yep. Huh? Where am I? A boy's voice. Hey! Chan Xing! Is that you in there? Who's there? My name is Diol. Your father asked me to find you. My father? Oh, right. I guess I fell asleep after hiding in here. I'm just glad you're safe. So, hey, the door seems to be locked. Can you open it from there? I can't! Hmm. Can you search the room for a key? You're kidding, right? I'm not doing that! I can't see a thing in here! What was that? I mean, it'd be easier for you to find a key, right? My father asked you for help, so do something to help me! Um, okay. Get a yeah, there is a kid. Already. Make me wait, and I'll tell my dad you were slacking off. Uh, fine. Hold on. Go on. Get going. Can you hear me? Get me out of here. This is taking forever. I'm looking for the key as we speak. Can't you do anything right? Get me out of here. But I thought there was a kid. Hmm. Huh. 
Find out where Jian Shin is, but the room is locked and I can't get him out. Find the room key. Oh boy. I'm gonna run out of time to save him. Thank you. I just need. Ask me anything. I'm trying to get into the room on the floor below here. Why that room? Last I heard, it was empty. There's a lost child in there who won't come out. Oh dear. Is there a key for it somewhere? I'm afraid that we do not have one here. The ship's captain does carry a master key on his person, however. That'd be upstairs. Where can I find this captain? Unfortunately, he is not on board. He is on leave until the ship's departure. Do you have any idea where he went? Hmm. I'm afraid I know little about how he spends his free time. I understand. Be that as it may. Yes? Did you think of something? If I'm not mistaken, there is a spare key in the wheelhouse. The wheelhouse, huh? Yes. Got it. Thank you very much. Excuse me. Thank you. We are. C you will not. Challenge. Yes. I'm good. All right. Th today's. Ch All right. Um, is there a key? The captain has. I'm fairly sure. The wheel has. Captain has a key, but he's out. There's a spare key in the wheelhouse. Search the wheelhouse. Is the wheelhouse that this? Huh. What? Hmm? Token? That's so. Hmm. the wheelhouse of the room upstairs. It was blocked off before. Oh, it's open now. Okay. Now I gotta investigate. There's the key. Niawu Walker. It's a guidebook for Niawu. This one is interesting. Get a hang on replica. Here's the key. I found it. I'll take this. Well, he wasn't sitting there anymore, he was gone. Found the key. He wasn't sitting there anymore. That was easy to find. <laughs> oh, whoops, whoops. Wait a minute, wait a minute. This is... This is... Okay. See, there's multiple keys. So, like, there's one key that opens it. So... I found it. So it may not just be one key. Yeah, these are all nondescript keys. So that's the thing. Gotta be on the lookout. I'd best not touch this. Another. 
So we're going to get a bunch of keys, but only one of them opens the door. Oh, this is... There's nothing out of the ordinary. I knew it wouldn't be that easy. So I can steer the ship with this, huh? Oh, it's about to be nine o'clock, too. About to run out of time. Hey, what's up, Nerd Strategy? Yeah, the dad was not over here. Oh, there he is. Yep, he's gambling. He's gambling. Hi there. Slow. Turtle right. Oh. What? Regret. Hmm. Um, excuse me. Oh, it's you again. Do you know where my son is? Yes. He's in a room on the lower floor of this ship. He appears to be safe. Oh, good. I'm I was getting gameplay of Supersonic Warriors with PVA. It's for the week's bid. Got carried away. You remember how fun that game was. Okay. Yeah, it's Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball Z. The door is locked and... Oh, who cares? He's safe. Now I can game in peace. Huh? I finally got a little luck on my side. Wait, what? That's great. But your son... He's... I trust you've got things under control. Wow. <laughs> um, I just... Anyway, it's been fun chatting and all, but I've got a hot hand to ride. You can't be. I'm counting on you. I'm sure you are. <laughs> it's nine o'clock. It's getting late. This can wait until tomorrow. Wow, look at that. He don't give a shit about his kid. Shenhua? Hi, Leo. We've got to find my father. The city's... I know. Dad will be Leo. here. <laughs> I'm going... Okay. So did he purposely hide his kid in there? Is that, is that what he did? Oh man, normally when I go to the hotel, that's time for me to leave the stream, but I gotta see this through. But I'll, I'll play a little bit longer and see how much more uh, there is to this mission. Looks good. Guess I'll take it. Gotta get my freebie first. Alright, so it's time to run back to the ship and see what's going on. Yes? You need to down to. No. Ah, uh, thank you. Thank you. Good morning. Morning. Did you get a. Yeah. Yes. I Good. Okay. You too.
All right, here it is. The thrilling conclusion to the saga of the little prick. Coming in hot. You know what though, I'm just curious, like, talk to that again. A Shenhua? Oh yeah, she's... Wait a minute. Wait. That's him. That's the kid. He's out. Did I fail the mission because I couldn't finish it in one day? Ooh. Oh, man. So wait, what happens? The kid is there. What the hell? Hello there. Oh, um, it's about your son. My son came back safe and sound. I'm so relieved. Glad things worked out. After I asked you for help, the captain found him for me. Is that right? Yes, but I could have saved myself a whole lot of stress if only you'd found him first. Uh, I'm sorry. Well, it is what... Right. So by doing this, you don't get a prize. So I need to do it in time to get a prize, which is why I had a feeling this would happen, and that's why I didn't save. That's why I didn't save. So now I gotta haul ass. And find the keys, and then come back. Oh boy. This is a race against time at this point. I had a feeling, I had a feeling that was the case. It just something told me not to save, because I always save. Shit. Alright, I gotta, I gotta talk to the lady in the front desk. Then she tells me I can go upstairs. Alright. Here we go. Or wait, did I talk to the kid already before I saved, or...? Mm -hmm. Hey! Yeah, uh -huh. A boy's boy? Who is... My name is... My I'm just glad... Can you open... I can't... Hmm... You're a kid... What was that? I mean, my father... Um... Get a... Fine. Go on! Alright, so now we gotta haul ass. Go, 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 go. So now I gotta test it. I'm, I'm just testing. Can I bypass talking to the lady? Can I just run up there? No. I gotta talk to her first. Shit. Alright. Okay, won't well, let me open the door. Let me try that again. Hey! Yeah, uh -huh. A boy's boy? Who is it? My name is... My father. I'm just glad... Can you open... I can't... Hmm... You're a kid. What was that? I mean, my father... Um... Get a... Fine. Go on! Okay.
So I gotta talk to the lady. I mean, it's seven o'clock, so I do have time. So Thank you. I just need. Ask me. I'm trying. To Why that? There's a lost. Oh dear. Is there? A I'm a. F the ship. Where can I? Unfortunately. Do you have any? Hmm. I understand. Be that. Yes. If I'm not. The wheel. Ha yes. Got it. All right. There's that. Now I can go upstairs. Key number one. I found it. Getting hot here. I'll take this. Key number two. This is... This is... It was, but I don't know. Maybe just the pressure of being on time. Now I'm getting hot. I found Get all it. hot and bothered. Right, uh, there was, what, third one over here, behind the ship. It's the pressure, man. Why is this here? Was it just three keys? Oh, this is... Yeah, I think it was just three. Okay, so room two. Three. All right, I'll ask again. Oh, that key actually worked. So that was actually the key behind the ship. And I gotta look for a little tubby. So I have about an hour to find him. There's that Sailor Moon boy. Surprised to see this in China too. This little secret lair looks good. Why is this here? The broken toy from the previous quest. There he is. Shanshan. Are you all right? <sighs> Whoa, easy now. Really?
Huh? Took you long enough. Sheesh. Excuse me? Oh, great. I've been here so long, I'm hungry now. I see. Hey, Slowpoke, go get me some dim sum. Why do I have to? Because it's your fault. You didn't rescue me earlier. Whatever you say. Let's get you back to your father. <laughs> I can make it out on my own. Later, Slowpoke. Hey, wait. <sighs> What's up with that kid? Definitely looks like diamonds and peaches. Yeah. Yo, look at how he walks. I was so scared. Oh, Xiaoxing, my sweet little boy. Oh, it's okay now. Daddy's here. <laughs> Daddy. Oh, he's evil. There, there. Daddy is so sorry. You can have any toy you want, okay? Really? I promise. Just say the word and Daddy will get it for you. Yeah! Oh, thank you so very, very much. I don't know how to repay you. No, please. At least take this. It's a ticket for the big wheel. Hmm? Oh, um, thanks. Xiaoxing, now it's your turn to say thank you to this young man. What? I mean, okay. Thank you very much, sir. Don't mention it. I'll be on my way then. Yes, of course. Thank you again. Wait. Take care, Slope. I mean, sir. You just fart? What? <laughs> Oh damn, 20 tickets. My father was happy, he gave me a big wheel tickets as thanks. Okay. Alright. Well. All's well that ends well, I suppose, even though the dad is gone again. Hey. Hey, mister. I should kinda thank you. Kinda, huh? You can keep that stuff I did a secret, can't you? What stuff? I don't honestly have to tell you, do I? Damn, you are slow. You mean all of the mischief you caused? I wouldn't call it mischief. I was just having a bit of fun. Anyway, just don't tell my dad, okay? We good? Ah, uh, if you say- Yo, he's so fat, it's hilarious. But don't you think he's bound to find out eventually? Huh? I mean, the entire ship is mad at you. Seriously? Guess they can't take a joke. <laughs> but don't you think they'll tell your father? Ah, I see your point. I wouldn't want that. Well, like it or not, it's coming. Oh, uh, come on, mister. Get me out of this mess. I don't think so. Oh, man. Great, I love it. It was so worth it to do it. Hi there. Oh, it's you. I really owe you one. It's a huge relief having my son back safe and sound. I'm glad to hear it. I really hope to learn from this experience and cut back on gambling from now on. I think that's for the best. Well then, see you around. Maybe the kid should lay off the dum dums. Oh boy, that kid. But that kid makes the sound of the animal crackers before eating. Oh man, first, first, first. I lost. All right, cool. Well, that's a good way to end it. Go back to the hotel. That sounds like Shinchan. I wonder if that was the same voice actor. I have no idea who you're talking about. Shinchan, who's that? Like some Naruto or something? I should get back to the hotel. Yeah. All right, cool. I feel accomplished now. Hi, the we've got to the cities. I know. 
be all. I'm going to go back to the room. Okay. All right, so. Just out of curiosity. Let me see if she's uh, on the balcony. She's probably reading a book, but it never hurts to check. Yep, she's reading. Okay. Alright, cool. Very good that I did not save, because I had a feeling that the mission was tied to one day. So, I have to keep that in mind now. Guess I'll take it. And uh, thank you, uh, for those of you watching, for third rank FPS one of John for uh, for sticking with me to the bitter end here for this uh, side quest. I'll be able to sleep better knowing that I finished it. So. It took longer than I expected, but got the job done, so not bad. Sense of accomplishment. Great. Right, cool. So right now, how many tickets do I have for the big wheel? 26. Cool. Alright. So, with that, I will save. Back out. That's good. Good, uh, got to get some side DLC done. Always nice to mix it up a little bit. All right, awesome. Very cool. So I just want to say thank you to those of you uh, who are watching again. Uh, Frank, one of John, third strategy. Uh, F Rax the Great stopped in earlier. Uh, who else am I missing here? Uh, I just don't want to miss anyone. I don't think I did. Oh, Jason Heffernan for popping in on Facebook earlier. Appreciate it. And I think that's it. So yeah, thank you. Thank you guys for hanging out. Appreciate it. And uh, enjoy the rest of the day. Get some sleep. Sleep is very important. And just because Frank is here. Just remember what old Smokey the Bear says. Only you can prevent forest fires, alright? So, be good, be safe. Peace.